April 20th, 2010. An explosion in the Gulf of Mexico sets off the nation's worst oil spill, leaving behind scenes like this along much of the Gulf Coast. Over 1,000 miles of shoreline were oiled. Three years later, things seem to be back to normal above water. Visually, the coast looks great. But it's what's below the surface that's concerning environmentalists. That a tremendous amount of the oil, the heavier tars, and where tar had accumulated organic material and so forth, on the coastline, a lot of that got buried. Six million pounds were removed from Louisiana in 2012. So we are far from a stage where everything's been cleaned up. And the fishing industry is still trying to catch up. You know, when you lose uh, a customer base uh, due to a, a disaster like a, a BP oil spill or uh, something that's not controlled, a, we- a, a weather event, um, you know, we have to work that much harder to get those guys back to, to, to capture what we lost. It's still unknown who will be held accountable for the disaster and the ongoing recovery. A trial underway in New Orleans will determine how much each company represented on the Deepwater Horizons drilling rig is responsible for the explosion. Bob McCall, Associated Press.